Hello everybody and welcome back to Yalan app. In this video, I'm going to show you a step-by-step -step guide on exactly how to fix Zangi app registration problem. So if you're currently having problems that you're not able to registrate an account on Zangi, then this video is going to help you to fix this problem. So actually what I did myself is that I firstly closed my Zangi app and instead I went into the settings app on my phone. So I just went into my settings app on my phone instead and in here I just scrolled down and then I clicked where it says general. So I clicked on general and as you can see you should now be taken to a page very similar to this. Now what I did on this page is that I scrolled down in here a little bit and then I clicked on storage as you can see. So I just clicked on storage and then I just waited a couple of seconds for this page to completely load in here. And as you can see now when this page is loaded then perfectly what we can do now is to just swipe up like this until we can see the search bar up top. So that is really good. When you see the search bar up top, just click on it, search for Zangi in here and then click on the app. And now in here, it's going to be very simple. What I did in here is that I firstly clicked on, clicked on offload app. And then once again, I clicked on offload app in here. And then I just waited a couple of seconds and then I clicked on the reinstall app button here once again. So I'm just going to click on it. Sometimes you have to click on it two times just so you know. And now just simply wait for the app to completely update to its latest version. So I did this and then I went back into the app and I tried once again to register. And after that it actually worked for me. So I guess that if you still have like an old update for example or like an old version of, version of the Zangi app. Then you have to be able to actually auto update the app to its latest version. And you will be able to do so by following this step by step guide. So when it's done, go back into the app, try once again, and hopefully now it's fixed for you as well.